Alright, so people have been asking me um, how I'm getting the high definition button on YouTube when I don't have a high definition camera or anything. Um, it's all in the render settings that I use, and I'll show you those right now. Um, if you use Sony Vegas 8.0 or 7.0, this is the video for you. Um, probably works with all Vegases, but those are the only two I've tried. So basically, first of all, just open up your video. Um, I'm just using a video of me laying down the drum track for a new song, whatever. Um, highlight your video, and go to File, Render As, and you want to render it as Windows AVI, uncompressed, so just the, the very first thing on the template drop-down thing. Um, render loop region only and save it as whatever you want, I don't care. And uh, then you're good to go. People have been telling me that if you just render it as QuickTime and 3 MBPS best um, and high definition 1200 by 720 um, that it's going to work but it does not, didn't work for me. I only got the high quality button not the HD button so I suggest you just uh, do what I'm doing here with the AVI uncompressed and then we'll compress it using a different program. So right now it's rendering whatever, let it render, it'll take a little while. Okay, you're going to find the video on your desktop or wherever you rendered it to. It's 14.8 gigabytes. Um, you think, whoa, that's huge, but that's exactly what you want. It's uncompressed, you want a big file size. Next you want to, you're going to want to get a program called MPEG Stream Clip. So just go to Google and type in the name of it or type in uh, MPEG Stream Clip free download or something, I don't know. And uh, there it is. It's totally free and it works great. Once you've got the program, simply just open it up and open your file, wherever you saved it to, the big 14 gigabyte file, whatever it is. Um, then you want to go to File, Export to QuickTime, and then these are the settings you need. Compression H.264, quality 100%, um, sound uncompressed, that's what gives you that nice um, perfect sound. You want to check off frame blending and deinterlace video so you don't get that liney footage. Um, size, you want 1280 by 720, that's your HD size. And data rate, it can be whatever you want as long as it's under one gigabyte because that's YouTube's new uh, size. So I usually make it as high as possible or just halfway or whatever I feel like. Um, I'd go for as high as possible, especially if it's a long video. And then I'm just going to let you guys look at this for a sec. And then when you're done, you just click make movie and it will save and you'll find it wherever you put it to. I saved mine to desktop, so here it is. I'm um, just going to double click on it, show you uh, what it looks like. Kind of slow. Alright, so it's nice and big. It's HD size, but when you put it on YouTube, it gets taken down about that size, so you can imagine how it starts to look better. So here I'm going to show you guys the settings again. You can just pause it or whatever and write them down or print screen from earlier or something but these are the settings you'll need to get HD um, you can change them a bit but I know for sure that these work so your best bet is just uh, using these um, whatever that's that's what I use um, so people will stop asking and see you later